I'm about to pour all my love into this video. What's good, Power Director Peeps? Yes, that's right, it's Saturday. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make the drink pouring effect using Power Director 18 or Power Director 365. If you're new to this channel and you wanna learn how to use Power Director, click on the subscribe button and click on the bell so that you get notifications every time I upload content to YouTube. If you've always wondered how they made this effect, I want you to put hashtag drink pouring effect in the comment section below. Here we are in Power Director. The drink pouring effect makes it look like you're pouring a drink of your favorite whatever. Well, I guess anything besides an actual drink into a glass. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to make the drink pouring effect for your videos. Let's get thirsty. As you can see, I have a clip in the media library of wine being poured into a glass. If I go ahead and click on the play button here, you will see that it is a thirst quenching, delicioso drink of wine. And I want to make it look like a girl dancing, this girl dancing, as a matter of fact, is being poured into the glass rather than the wine being poured into the glass. Now, keep in mind, this effect works best when you have an object that is against a all white background. All right. Now, let's go ahead and get cracking. First thing we want to do is add this clip of the wine to track one in our timeline. So I'm going to hold down my left mouth button over this clip and I'm going to drag it down to track one. Then I want to drag the video of the girl dancing down into track two of the timeline. So I'm going to hold down my left mouth button and then I'm going to drag this down to track two at the position where I think I want the girl to show up in the video. And I think that's good right there. So I'm going to let go of my left mouse. Next thing I need to do is scale this so that the woman is only over the glass. So I'm going to left click on the clip of the girl dancing. I'm going to tap F2 on my keyboard to bring up the PIP designer. And then here I'm going to change the scale of this. You can use your sliders here to change the scale and bring it down to it just covering the glass. And I actually think that's pretty good right there. So at this point, I'm going to go ahead and click on OK. Now I need to enable blend modes so that the two clips blend together seamlessly and it'll look like the girl is being poured into the glass instead of the wine. So I'm going to right click on the clip of the girl dancing. I'm going to go to set clip attributes. And I'm going to go to set blending mode. And for the blending mode, I'm going to select lighten. Now, if I tap on my space key on my keyboard to play this back, you'll see that the video of the girl dancing is filling up the glass instead of the actual wine. Now, you might want to add some fades to this to just kind of make it look a little smoother when it comes on to the screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the transition room. And under general, I'm going to add a fade. I'm going to left click, hold down my left mouth button and drag it to the beginning of this clip. I'm going to add another one at the end, the actual same fade transition. So left click, hold down my left mouth button, drag it down to the end. And then we can play this back and see what it looks like. And that's how you make the drink porn effect in Power Director 18 and Power Director 365. If you decide that you like Power Director and you want to buy or upgrade to the software or purchase a 365 annual subscription, I'll leave some links in the video description. Don't forget to drop me a comment and a like down below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.